In this video, I'm going to share 12 tips how you can cut your fuel consumption by 50%. No investment in any way is required and these tips can be implemented instantly. This video is presented to you by The German Engineer, your channel for money, saving, efficiency and growth. Before we go in each of the 12 saving tips, give me one minute to share the overview of five cost items that the average car owner has to consider. The biggest item is depreciation. In other words, the loss in value over time. Then the operating cost. Fuel consumption is the biggest part of it, followed by car wash and engine oil. The next one is the fixed cost. Biggest in this category are taxes and insurance. Maintenance, including small repairs, inspection, oil change and tire replacement comes after that. And the last one, residential parking plus other small items. For each $100 spent, $44 goes to depreciation, $20 to operating cost, $14 to fixed cost, $12 to maintenance and $10 to other items. The fuel saving tips explained in this video make the majority of operating cost with 16 out of $100 spent. If you are interested how you can become a millionaire by avoiding the car completely, check out my other video which I will link at the end. Let's get started. 12. Refueling Filling up the tank when your warning light pops up can be a big mistake. Often, the next gas station is not the cheapest. To avoid this trap, compare gas stations nearby your daily routes. In general, gas stations at the highway tend to be most expensive. The cheaper ones you find at locations off the main roads and busy districts. Often, the best choice are private operated gas stations. Also, in peak hours, when most people commute between work and home, the fuel is at its daily high. Plenty of apps are available that list prices of stations nearby. With this, you can save 5 to 10 percent. 11. Carpool This one seems to be logical, but it is a big saving contributor. If you arrange a carpool sharing your route with three more people, you split the fuel bill by four and consequently save 75 percent. This works ideal for commuting between your home and work. 10. Air condition and parking heater These devices are a luxury in hot summer and cold winter periods. Depending on the actual usage, you can save 20% by not using them. 9. Turn off motor on average, a 3-liter engine burns the equivalent of one coffee cup fuel for every 10 minutes idle. Therefore, turn off the engine when you expect to stand for 60 seconds and more. Do you know the main reason for high fuel consumption? It comes down to the effect described in physics as aerodynamic drag or resistance generated by the interaction and contact of a solid body with air. In other words, the shape and the velocity of the car are the main reasons for high fuel consumption. Why is this important to mention? The next 8 tips are all based on the aerodynamic drag. If you understand this basic concept, you can apply it to many different ways for reducing your fuel consumption. 8. Speed The average car drives at its most economical mode between 50 and 80 km per hour. For example, if you drive 120 km per hour, you consume 20% more fuel compared to 100 km per hour. On a trip of 25 km, only 2 minutes of time would be saved anyhow. 7. Acceleration The faster the acceleration, the higher the fuel consumption. 
the lowest fuel consumption can be achieved by accelerating slowly and switching early in a higher gear. If the car is automatic, check if it has the echo function, which basically does this early switch in higher gear for you. Predictive driving. Every time you hit the brakes, you are losing forward momentum and have to accelerate again. Therefore, try to look ahead and predict the upcoming events so you can adjust your speed beforehand. It saves fuel as you will brake and accelerate less. 5. Cruise control. This tip is suggested especially on highways. Tests have shown that varying your speed up and down between 75 and 85 km per hour every 18 seconds can increase your fuel consumption by 20%. To avoid this higher consumption, set up the cruise control at a decent speed. 4. Tires If the pressure in your tires is too low, the aerodynamic drag will increase. This can lead to 5% more fuel consumption and also reduce the lifetime of the tire by 10,000 kilometers. Look up the pressure for your tires on the placard, often located at the edge of the driver's door or door post. And also the size of the tire plays a role. The larger your tire, the higher the fuel consumption. To achieve maximum saving, choose the smallest possible tire and check the pressure once a month. 3. Windows Keep them closed when driving, especially on highways during high speed. When your windows are open, they cut the aerodynamic airflow and consequently increase the drag. This leads to a higher fuel consumption. 2. Car rack All devices that are assembled outside the car will increase the aerodynamic drag and consequently the fuel bill. Keep them off when not needed to save money. Number 1 and last. Don't keep unnecessary weight in the car. Toolboxes, sports equipment and many more contribute to a heavier load and consequently a higher fuel consumption. For a medium-sized car, you can assume for every 25 kg you add, the fuel consumption will go up by 1%. If you are keen to find out how a car keeps you from becoming a millionaire, check out the other video which I'm linking here. If you enjoyed the summary, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel so you will not miss out on any update. This video was presented to you by The German Engineer, your channel for money, saving, efficiency and growth.